What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Subnautica Below Zero. So last episode, we went over to the glacial area, the robotics. We went over to the Fees Robotics landing pad. We checked out some things. We got this Snow Fox built. Now, we are going to have to... Uh, we're going to have to go out and explore with it. But I came back to the base, and I was like, you know what? This place is just rough. We're going to do some base building today. And I've already actually started base building. And I thought I was recording almost half an episode ago. So let me catch you up to what has happened. If you guys enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like if you're new here. Don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. So what we have here is uh, I added another large room and we put a T here and we put a glass thing there and we put a control room there. All right, cool. You're caught up. <laughs> it was like super fast. Trust me, it was a lot longer uh, before. Anyways, um, I had to throw some reinforcements in here because the base was getting rough. And as you can see, we put a uh, partition here, put a wall because this is going to be like the bedroom area kind of stuff. And then in here, we have the restroom. <gasps> Look at that. We have a shower. We have a toilet. It's in process. I have to get more titanium. Um, titanium is an issue right now, so I'm constantly having to go out and get it. But we have... Uh, oh, you can interact? Can you interact with the toilet, too? That would be hilarious. Um, but we have this. This is going to be like the bedroom. We're going to set up, you know, the bed in here and, like, all the fun stuff. Uh, and then we have the control room over here. The control room is pretty cool. You can see what time of day it is. You can see the structural integrity overall is 11. Uh, power statistics, we're drawing 0.85 power. We're producing zero right now currently, and that's not an issue. And yes, so that's what's going on. But I realized I wasn't recording, and yeah, no, not fun. Not fun whatsoever. So we are going to do some base building. We're going to get this place looking spiffy. And I think we might actually add some more things. So I want to kind of see what we need for the nuclear reactor because i think we have the stuff to make the nuclear reactor uh and i feel like that's just like super sci-fi and super like high tech stuff we could make the bio reactor honestly i think the bio reactor is usually the way to go but the nuclear reactor why not we might as well make it uh so we'll need a plastic and get advanced wiring and lead so we'll have to go out and get those i'd like to get an alien containment i basically just want to get a base that has like everything actually do these even work oh <gasps> they're like they're like oval Oh, no way. Oh, no way. Wait, would this, will this fit in this one where I have this like half partitioned? Oh, <laughs> that's going there for sure. That is super cool. I'm going to start that. Okay, so we need five glass and two titanium. Not bad, not bad. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Anyways, yes, we're going to go ahead. We're going to get started now. I got to go out and find some more titanium because I am like, I am. I'm going out for titanium and I keep getting copper. So like I have all the copper I could need, but I need titanium. So I'm going to go out, get some more titanium and uh, yeah, we'll be back. We'll be building some things. We also need five glass. We need five glass. You know what? I'm going to go grab the quartz first because I know where quartz is at for sure. Quartz is like actually probably easier to find than the titanium is right now. So, um, all right, let's do this. All right. Five glass, two titanium, easy peasy. Let's get this guy built. This is going to be epic. An aquarium just <gasps> or your yes. own personal sushi factory. You decide. Your own personal sushi factory? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay, how much titanium did I get? I got three titanium. Um, I was looking for titanium walls out too, so of course. Now, we got that in there. And then we have a garden area over here. So we're going to make... I think I'm actually going to move some of this stuff to like one side and I also want to make it accessible. So I think I'm going to go with the plant pots instead of these big gardens because these big gardens are kind of hard to get the stuff in the middle with. Whereas these like they're super easy. You can spread them out all nice and neat like. And uh, yeah, we might have some of these for decoration purely, but I don't know. Um, What else can we build? Let's look at other miscellaneous stuff. So we have a vending machine. We've got uh, executive toys. We got wall shelves. We got all kinds of fridge keeps food cold and prevents it from spoiling. That's always handy. Uh, we have different types of beds, which are kind of cool. Um, so we'll probably take that one apart and build one of these. I don't know which one though. This one had like the weird little dragon like sheets on it. This one has like, is that like an ocean scene on it? That one's Sam's It has like the gears on it. That's kind of neat. We might go with that one. Uh, we'll have to make a desk and stuff like that. So let's redo. Let's redo some of this stuff. Actually, I need to make a storage room. I think we should make a storage room or a storage area. 
I think that's going to be this area right here. Now, do I want to go wall lockers? Or do I want to go with the bigger lockers? Because these ones hold more. But they do require a quartz. But these ones we can label. Uh, Let's go with wall lockers. I think we'll go with wall lockers. Yeah, let me build another one. We'll put it right here. And I think we'll just put them right in, in like in these squares right here. Because I got to get stuff moved over from the other base. We still have the other base over there and it's like completely full of stuff. So we need to move that all over here as well. Awesome. Okay. So this area is pretty much cleaned out. Um, the only thing we're gonna have left, we'll take down this habitat and we'll move some plants over. Now, while I was doing the storage stuff, I kind of was rethinking what, uh, my decision a little bit here. So we're going to move the storage kind of around again because yes all right so we're gonna have these wall lockers on here wall lockers we're gonna have these wall lockers on here and then what i'm gonna do is we're actually gonna move up uh, a whole bunch of this stuff like that and we're actually gonna clear these out because i'm gonna use these for bigger uh bigger storages because we're gonna just have too much stuff and i know we're not gonna be able to fit everything in these all right, so these ones, we're actually going to put them like this. Ooh. We'll see how many we can squeeze right here. Okay, so we'll put those there. I'll probably put, honestly, I'm probably going to run these the length of this wall right here because we're just going to have too much stuff. We'll put the high valuable stuff in here, uh, but the bulk stuff's just going to go in here, you know? All right, so that's looking good. That's looking good. This guy's going to get moved. Uh, and then we need to redo the plants as well do i have uh let's make sure we grab some of these seeds wait a second can i not grab the the fruit off of these oh yes i can i just have to be like very careful okay all right so that looks good let's go ahead and uh we're gonna redo this area how much inventory space do i have Ooh, not a lot not a lot Okay, so since, since we just picked up the bed, let's put the bed away as well. Where do we want the bed? Like, do we want it right next to the bathroom? I mean, I guess we kind of do. Uh, We'll go with this one. We'll put it, like, right here. That'll work. And then, okay, we'll do, we'll deal with uh, making the bedroom look good later. <laughs> One thing at a time. Let's get the let's get the function first over form. All right, so I think this is how we're gonna do this. Is we're gonna put. Hmm. I wonder if I could. I could probably put a row here and then a row closer to the wall. That we can walk down both rows if we need to. Let's do that. You know, how much room do I really need for a garden? Because this stuff grows pretty darn fast. I'm not, I don't think we're going to need that much room, to be honest. Like, I almost feel like one side would probably be plenty of room. Like, if we just followed, like, a line like this. I think this is going to be un plenty enough plants. Like, I think that's going to be plenty enough. And then I can go ahead and throw uh, throw one of these in each one. Actually, I can throw more than one in each one. I can throw, like, four in each one. So we'll do that, and then we'll get these, uh, these guys. And we'll throw one in there. One in there. I think we're going to have plenty of room, to be honest. I th or I think we're going to have plenty of crops, anyways. You know what? Let's just do two more. Let's do Let's just do two more. And I think that'll be that'll be plenty. There we go. Okay, cool. And then we'll put the uh, the Preston leaves in there, and we'll place that one in there. Fantastic. And let's just go ahead and eat these. Delicious. So that's gonna be like our farm right here. This is our farm. It looks good. It's gonna feel good. It's gonna be nice. Now the refrigerator would ideally go next to that. Maybe with like a counter or something like that. Hmm. Because like we should have like a food area. Kind of need a fabricator too, like you know the fabricator for the food. It doesn't touch anything else but the food, you know, because you don't want your lubricant to be touching your your food, right? No, that's not what we want. That's not what anybody wants. All right, so let's throw a countertop right here, kind of just you know to break up the difference between the farm and not the farm. 
Uh, and then let's do, can I do a refrigerator? Fridge, I need glass. Let's see, let's go make some glass. I hopefully have stuff for the glass. I have stuff for glass? I have stuff for glass, wonderful. So we'll go ahead and throw a refrigerator right there. Nice. Uh, I feel like the vending machine should go right there. Vending machine's glass too? Oh, come on. Do I even have enough stuff for another glass? I have one quartz. <laughs> Do I have any more quartz? Ah, one more quartz. Okay, perfect. So we can make, uh, we can make our vending machine. We also need the espresso machine to be doing its thing. All right, so there's the vending machine. I don't know who stocks this, but man, bless their hearts, you know? <laughs> um, And then where's that espresso machine at? Is that not in here? Is it interior pieces? Oh, it is an interior piece. Uh, We also gotta get the jukebox. 100% have to get that. And then the Recyclotron, uh, we're gonna make that too, because like, of course, why not? Vending machine. That should go like right here, huh? Ah. Oh. The sweet, scent oh, of dirty bean water. the sweet scent of dirty bean water. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so fridge. Oh my gosh, it holds a whole bunch of goodies. That's wonderful. Okay, so those are all planted. Uh, we have to get some more Preston leaves or whatever to plant in that one. Oh, we need a fabricator. We need to get a fabricator over here because I want to make this stuff specifically over here. So we need two quarts and... Mm, I think I'm out of quarts. Yeah, I'm out of quarts. Okay. So we need more quartz and titanium. All right, quartz and titanium. Not bad, not bad. Uh, okay, so what did I want to make? I wanted to make, oh, we wanted to make the, oh shoot. Uh, I need to drop off something because I have too much of something. Uh, we'll drop off the copper and grab the battery. I threw the battery on the charger while it's gone. So that way I could replace the battery on this guy because it, uh, it was running a little low. But I want to make a fabricator, so oh, I just need that two <laughs> the two copper that I just put in here. <laughs> All right, so let's throw the fabricator right here. This is for food processing fabrication. Ta-da! Okay, that's looking mighty fine. But we need, you know what? We need to get um, where's the jukebox? We need the jukebox. That needs to be in here, like. And I think it should be right here, right when you walk in. Right there. And then we need to get some speakers. The lets you listen to music in your base. No one said survival couldn't be funky. <laughs> no one said survival couldn't be funky. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay, so there's that. Let's go ahead and put this speaker... Over here. And then let's see, I need, what do I need for speakers? Titanium and copper? Okay, I have plenty of copper. I've been getting copper like nobody's business. All right, we'll throw a speaker in here. We'll throw one in the room. I think that looks pretty good. All right, so let's let's see what we got for music here. Now, I'm really hoping that this isn't mono, like this isn't gonna get copyrighted, but I'm, you know, Oh, I like that. Oh, that sounds nice. Uh, where's the one? There's one. Diving in too deep. I like this one. This is like hands down my favorite one. Yep. I like that one. Okay, but I'm going to turn it off because I don't know if it's going to get me copy striked or not. So, sorry, but we have it. We have it. It's good. It's good. It's good. Okay. Um, I really need these waters. Okay, let's go ahead and drink those. Mm. Delicious. Fantastic. Okay, so we got that. We got that. Oh, let's see what else. Oh, I know what we wanted. One of the biggest things. I wanted the glass dome on this thing. So I need enameled glass. I need four enameled glass. Holy enameled glass. Oh, it's lead. Lead, glass, and diamond. Diamond I have. Lead I do not. Oh, wait. Yes, I do. The bases of uh, the foundations. The foundations of the other place are made of lead, right? Yeah, the foundations over there are made of lead. Uh, I just gotta move plants over. Okay, hold on, let me clear out my inventory, let me move plants, and then I'll take those foundations, and that'll give me uh, some lead. Yes, okay, I, don't, I was like, I don't wanna go search for lead. Lead is like one of the, my least favorite things to go out and look for. Yeah, I'm pretty sure each of these foundations is like two lead. 
So that would be like plenty, plenty of lead. Um, okay, so let's grab. Grab one of those. Uh let's go ahead and cut up one of these. Perfect. Okay, I don't care about those. We'll go grab some gel sacks. Actually, let's grab some seeds. Let's grab some of these spiral plant. And we'll grab some ribbon plant. Can we get Oh, ribbon plant seeds? Heck yes. Um, I think that's everything. Okay, cool. I'm going to disassemble these. I can disassemble it with the stuff in it and just disappears, which is fine. And then I'll grab the foundations, which should have the lead. Oh, my inventory's full. I better have gotten that lead. Okay. All right. Hey, our whole base is gone now. Look at that. Who knew? Never knew the day would come, would you? Now, I am going to have to move my... I'm going to have to move these in order to put... Oh, no. No, I didn't actually have to do that. Okay, cool. Let's go. Well, I probably will move them afterwards, though, because it's going to look really weird with, like, the solar panels, like, chilling on the roof right there, on the glass roof, you know? It's just not going to look right. All right, what else do I need for that? Uh, Two lithium. Easy enough, I think. All right, lithium de deposits are running a little low, too. Hello, large glass room. room large room glass dome. It's going to look so good. Oh, it's going to look so good. <gasps> Ta -da! oh that looks nice that looks okay i don't like those uh solar panels being there we'll move those on here and the reason i didn't want the glass room on this one is because the bedroom's right there and it's gonna be kind of creepy you know what i'm saying <laughs> it almost looks really dark in here i might actually switch that color back to white so it brightens it up because it's it's like really dark i don't like that yeah we're gonna switch that back to white it uh, i don't like it i don't like it it's it's dark and it's, it's too it's too much all right, let's see how this looks now. Are you white? Uh, yeah, see, that just looks better. I think that just looks better. We're just going to leave it like that. Okay. So that's moved over. That looks good. That looks good. Um, Now, like I said, I wanted to throw a nuclear reactor in here. Mm, I don't want to go get that three lead, though. I really don't. And we kind of have enough power as it is. Well, we don't have power right now, technically, because, like, I moved all those solar panels. So, like, they're, they're kind of freaking out. But we're fine <laughs> it's not powered down yet so this thing is can't deconstruct water filtration machine container not empty okay hold on let's grab those um i'm gonna deconstruct this we're gonna move this over closer to the over here hopefully yeah that works just literally one, literally one tile over that's all we needed there we go. Perfect. Now it's going to kill the power, though, because I just reset that. So now it's going to try to pull water. OK, that's fine. So we need a place to sit to eat our foods. Um, Good spot, right? That looks good. We'll throw a swivel chair in here, put it right next to here. And I don't think we're going to have any friends come over. But in case we do, we'll throw <laughs> in case we have any friends. Am I seriously out of titanium? Come on uh okay let's grab all this now when i'm out i'm actually out and it's not gonna be fun all right so look at that in case we have friends come where we can sit there and we should be able to to sit in these chairs too all right um i do want to get the recyclatron oh we also need a trash can definitely need a trash can uh, actually the trash can is probably gonna go yeah we'll throw it right here right now actually can i rotate it long ways yeah we'll sneak it right here next to the vending machine perfect nice okay recyclotron where are you uh titanium ingot oh god oh there goes all my titanium <laughs> and then ion cubes i have a bunch in my prawn suit let me go grab one of those now um i do want to make some ion batteries however i want to keep a few ion cubes just in case we do end up having to make some tablets because i don't want to use all of them and kind of uh you know put myself out later okay so recycle what oh i was like this thing is massive all right let's put the recyclotron hmm Put it right here. Okay, let's see. This alien technology allows for the recycling of natural resource components without 
rinsing and sorting them into bins first. So what happens? If I recycle this, item cannot be recycled because it's already made. If I recycle this, cannot recycle used items. Wait, what? Oh. No battery and spectroscope. That's going to turn it into one titanium. I can't recycle a battery, though? What about a fully charged battery? Hold on a second. If I throw the battery on here and let it fully charge, would that let me recycle that? Hmm. What items do I have that I don't need? Uh, depleted reactor core? Maybe? Nope. <laughs> All the things that you want to recycle, you can't. Um... What else would I want to recycle? What about a power cell? Like, if I hit recycle... It's fully charged, right? Uh, that'll give me one silicone rubber. Mm. Yeah, I don't think it's worth it. I do want to see it go, though. Like, I want to see it work. You know what? We have an extra scanner. Let's try it on the scanner, okay? All right, scanner, no battery. Recycle. That was instantaneous. I want to look inside of it. Let me look inside of it. Ah. Okay. I mean, I guess that's kind of neat. So if you make like, you know, tool or you find like extra stuff that you don't need, that's eh, it's kind of handy. Kind of handy. It is a little bit picky on what it wants, though. Um, so the batteries do have to be full. Okay. All right. That's good to know. Now, what else do we have that we need? We already got those. Um, uh, power cell charger would be nice. Hmm. We also need to get fish in here. I want to finish decorating this place. Like, we really need to get some decor going in here. Can I build a... That executive toy is pretty cool. Uh, a counter? Is there, like, a closet? Like a wardrobe or something? There's not. So I guess a counter could be as close to a... As close to a, a thing as, I guess. I really like this executive toy. I feel like this should be out in the front. Let's put this out in the front. I mean, I guess we get a multiples, so it doesn't really matter. But still, let's put it like right here. Oh, we can we put it on this table? Oh, <gasps> perfect. Yes. The anti-gravity pendulum of this executive meditation tool spins indefinitely by conserving momentum and recycling energy. Oh, neato. There it goes. I can watch this for hours. I want one of these in real life. Okay. Sweet. <laughs> awesome. Our base is looking pretty good. I gotta say, it's it's not bad. It's not bad. I don't think it's done though. And I'm just my problem is I'm just I'm out of titanium. My gosh. I need more titanium. Cause like I'd love to get some picture frames. Oh, picture frames only require uh copper wire. I'd like to get some signs and stuff like that. I also don't know what happened to the uh the living wall the walls that have like all the uh, the vines and stuff on them those would be kind of neat to put in here as well and let's see is there anything else that's like neato that i have not made yet i don't think so i think we kind of got everything built for the most part i don't really need an aquarium because we have the gigantic aquarium already but i definitely feel like we need to fill this out a little bit more oh you know what we have a bunch of motivational posters uh, we have a picture of Robin. Oh, we can go put that in the room. That'll work. That'll that'll be perfect there. Um, where's all these motivational posters at? Oh, right there. There was a poster. Hoverball. Okay. And then poster sea truck. Jeremiah's bird wall. And that's cut. Interesting. Okay, so let's see what we got here. So. Poster of the Mercury 2. Man, that won't go right there. Man, these things take up a lot of room, don't they? Okay, I'll put one right... Hey, get... There! Oh, ho, ho, that thing is cool looking. <gasps> I didn't realize that's what it was. We'll put that next to the new sea truck. Neato. Uh, motivational poster. It's your field. 
Let's see, where can we put this guy? Right there. <laughs> That's perfect because it's right above our little farm thing. <gasps> Neato. All right, uh, bird wall. Where would we want a bird wall photo at? A picture. Oh, this could work right here. Okay. All right, well, that doesn't exist anymore. I'm telling you, I think the cut stuff doesn't exist. Just say no to sky rays. What? Just say no to sky rays. <laughs> Those are the stupid little pooping birds. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Uh, let's see what else. Keep calm and truck on. Oh, that's got to be a, a sea truck photo for sure. Maybe we should put something in here. Let's put something in here. Something right there. <gasps> oh, that's so cool. I didn't know I picked that one up. Uh, let's go to get the hoverball one too. Should we put hoverball? Let's put hoverball in here somewhere maybe there you go neato what else we got uh, we have framed pictures let's put the framed pictures in here on the counter there <gasps> look at that and then hand drawing uh, a potato portrait oh that sounds exciting oh it's potato the cat with a bionic arm Interesting. Hand-drawn pingling art. <laughs> Hold on, that's gonna go in the front. That's a good one. We'll put it right there. <laughs> this place is coming together. I like it. Just the photos alone can make it make a difference. Okay, do we have any more? I thought I had more than that. I thought we had like a lot. Yeah, we got one there. Uh, and you know what? I think I missed some. Back at the Fee Institute. Let's see, we got one there, we got one there. Let's see, this room in here is kind of, kind of boring. Let's put that there. Focus. <laughs> I think that's it. I think we're good. I think we're good. Awesome. All right. Well, that's going to end this episode. Um, we did a little bit of base building. We got some things rock and rolling. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think we should do. I feel like there's a, little, a lot of open space left. Um, I think this wall is probably going to end up getting filled up with storages along with that wall. I think it's going to be storages there, storages here for all kinds of things. Um, but I don't know. I feel like we need, I feel like we could use a few more, a few more things. I also need to populate this. Actually, I do have a sea monkey egg we could throw in here. Oh, I'm going to have to put a hatch on it though, huh? Yeah, I'm going to have to throw a hatch on it. Um, but yeah, leave a comment down below. What do you guys think we else we, we should do to the base place? I think it looks pretty neat. Oh, pretty nice so far. And next episode, we are actually going to go ahead and we're going to make the cold suit stuff. And then we will go to the Arctic area and explore that and check that out. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Make sure you stick around for that one. Make sure you leave a like and you're subscribed if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one.